Cammie Carver is fighting for her life. She needs a bone marrow transplant, and she needs it very quickly. Finding a bone marrow match has been described a little bit like finding a needle in a haystack. But as you'll see in this next story, becoming a donor what isn't all that hard. What are some things you tell yourself to make you happy? You know, like flying and riding unicorns and stuff like that. I like to think of that a lot. Eight-year-old Cammie Carver is a fighter. Riding a unicorn? Mm -hmm. Is that going to be the A number one thing you do when you get better? I want to. After beating leukemia once before. And I wanted to welcome you to my end of cancer video. It's back and Cammy is scared. It's been hard like going through this again. And so after the family thought they had beat this cancer and that their precious girl was in the clear, but it I begins know. again. I know about something like white blood cells and stuff. Three rounds of intense inpatient chemo. It's easier when you're bald because, like, you don't have any hair. And then more chemo and radiation to prep Cammie's fragile body for a bone marrow transplant. And I've done it before, so... Yeah. It has been a devastating blow. I went from trying to plan what she was going to wear for the first day of school, like, stressing about which outfit, to just wishing that we could like play with her in the sun for just 10 minutes. Suddenly, Pat and Chelsea transitioned from the typical worries of jobs, juggling household chores and small children, to facing hundreds of thousands of dollars in medical bills and fighting for their daughter's life. Even with insurance, the cost of this battle is astronomical. I get the bills in the mail, I throw them on my credit card, and you just kind of be like, well, I'll just put that aside, I'm not going to look at that right now. And to know that there's an army of people behind you, it just takes a huge burden off our shoulders, you know, as parents, and we can focus on her. And now, Pat and Chelsea gear up for the next battle royale, finding a bone marrow match for Cammie. It is her only hope. We were heartbroken to learn that our little son, he was kind of Cammie's one chance at being an easy bone marrow donor. We learned that he was not a match for her, which was really, really hard. <laughs> it's a hard day for all of us. Now we have to kind of go into the bone marrow registry, which is a worldwide thing. Getting on the donor list is easier than most of us think. A swab of the cheek and boom, you're on the bone marrow registry and you could potentially save somebody's life. Maybe a little girl like Cammie. All right, you ready to do this? Who on the night I meet her is facing another challenge with her usual charm and charisma. Thumbs up, Froggy. Thanks, Be careful. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, we got to get that hair off. Look at that. Oh, my God. oh, wow. How amazing would that be to get a phone call one day and be like, there's a little girl, she's dying, and you can save her life. You know, we are counting on somebody saying yes to that. In the meantime, Cammie is going to fight. Oh, I the eye of the tiger. Don't worry about me, because if I defeated it when I was four, I can probably defeat it again if I'm older. That kind of sums up who she is. Yeah. She's trying to make everybody else feel better. Like, don't worry about me. Yeah. I'll be okay. I can Poor beat thing. it. Uh, you have a chance to help Cami. A fundraiser is being held this Saturday in Bountiful from 3 until 7. Actually, what they're going to be doing there is doing those cheek swabs to see if you might be a potential bone marrow match. We have all the information on this fundraiser for you on our website at KUTV.com. I also have it on my personal Facebook page. Cool. I hope you'll put it on yours you as bet. well. Uh, we'll have it on our KUTV Facebook page as well. You can also go to their blog, which is kissesforcami.com. Uh, Chris, I have a present for you. Thank you. Yeah, this I'll put is that a on. Cami Strong bracelet. That's cool. And just, I swear this little girl has like glitter. And the music there in the end. You yeah. had a Katy Perry song. I understand that has some significance to Cam. That's her theme song to fight this. And she's just, she's a fighter. I mean, you can see that there's not a sense of, of sadness. There's a sense of resolve and a sense mm -hmm. of inner parents as well. Like she is going to beat this and she's going to fight right. it. And that's her theme song. Go, so, Cammie. Go, Cammie. Sweetheart. We're Cammie Strong here at 2 News. All right. For sure. Well, we need to check in with